Hello, I'm Paul Weller and you are watching NME.com. You know, I listen to all sorts of music really, so I think it all gets fed in really. And uh, I don't know if there's any one direct influence, I think it all just goes in there and gets processed and, uh, and comes out differently really. So if I listen to, for instance, John Coltrane, I don't want to play jazz and always play saxophone, but the greatness and what he's trying to do in the music and what indeed what he does do in the music, that's what I'm inspired by, by the greatness and trying to, <clears throat> at least trying to attain some of that, you know? Well, I suppose we can't help as human beings to all kind of put each other into little compartments. Um, but my tastes are so eclectic, I, I couldn't really do that, you know? I, I listen to all sorts of things, really, and all sorts of styles of music. Some I don't like and some I do, but I think um, I just see it all as music. I don't think of it just anymore as being one, this is, you know, country, this is heavy metal. I, you know, it's just all music. There's only two types of music. And that's one's good and one's shit, and that's it really for me. I think the older I've got, the more open-minded, broad-minded I've become with music definitely and lots of things really. Um, I think I was more narrow-minded when I was younger. But maybe that suits, when you're younger, maybe that's a good thing, because you just have this one vision that you're going towards. But um, <clears throat> I listen to, I kind of, yeah, I want to hear everything before I die, which is not possible, but I try and hear as much as is possible, really. For musicians, really, I, I personally feel that you, if you've got the right intentions, you'll, you start off on a level playing field anyway. I don't know if the age really comes into it, when you've got someone who's talented and as good as Josh as a guitarist I don't think about his age I just think how fantastic what fantastic player is and the same with the Sid Arthur boys as well you know at the same token you've got <clears throat> Steve Brooks who's my oldest mate who I've known I've known since I was 13 14 or whatever he's playing on it you know he's old like me but um so there's a whole breadth of it really you know but I just it is good to have the youth in there man because they bring something else to it but I think essentially it's just if you're a good musician I don't think I think it transcends ages or any of that stuff. Sid Arthur I think are really special I think they're really unique what they do and I don't know if many people have heard them yet but <clears throat> they know they're working on their second records but they're just yeah I think it's very special what they do they've got lots of different influences but it's very unique the way they put their stuff together and the stripes, I think, are great, you know. I think it's just, um, <clears throat> they just need to work on their songs, really, once the songwriting starts flowing, and I think it could be great, I think.